I don't know why I brought us back here, but I guess we just have to leave again. It happened last time too when it brought us back to the sewer. All right, uh, we'll leave. We'll go back up to the Empire Arms, which I think is right over here. And we do have to go to the Nocturne. Well, I guess we have to go to the Nocturne Theater. We can sell that knife later. Oh, I need to get into the Nocturne Theater from the sewer. So never mind. Let's do that. I'll sell the knife to Fat Larry right now as well. My man. David David Jacobi sick, sign seal is certified. Yo, 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 koala ears, lazy eye hammocks and dwarf saddle right here. Oh, yo, 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 koala ears, lazy eye hammocks and dwarf saddle right here. Only, yo, got a Galapagos turtle this week only. Yo, 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 I got dinosaur eggs. We don't know what kind. Buy them and hatch them. <laughs> Alright. So now we have to find the entrance to the Nocturne Theater. Three. Okay. It's gonna be to the left here. Apollo is here. Hello, Apollo. Access point B. I don't think we want B, do we? We want three. Oh no, we do. Okay. So this is it. This is where we're looking for. Nocturne Theater. And we gotta be sneaky here. Le course le vent. Lots of people just walking around. Oh, this is where the game started. Well, I have plenty of blood packs, so I'm not worried about that. I don't need to worry too much about blood running out. Really, this is what the Nocturne Theater looks like? Man, what a downer. Got that loaded up. What did his thing say to do? <sighs> Santa Monica. Hollywood. Need to enter Nocturne Theater through a sewers, mounted wireless camera near Red X, activated through the network terminal, which is in the basement of the theater with the password break a leg. All right, I'll try. My legs will be broken. Here we go.
enabled net security. Break a leg. Track net. You're a regular James Bond. Check your email soon. I'll be in touch. Mit -mit. Hey, we did it. <clears throat> Nothing in here. Okay, cool. Can't exit out this way, so we're gonna need to walk all the way back out through downtown and all that. Woo! We escaped. We got out. Not bad. Get some more blood, suck some rat. You know how it is. What a beautiful video game. They should just dump us somewhere outside, I think. And then we can go back to Santa Monica and check our email. Then we can go back to Hollywood and do the Tawny Sessions quest. Um, and also try to do... Is he gonna go back there? Don't touch me. Yeah. All right. Uh, we'll try to do the Tawny Sessions quest as well while we're in Hollywood. So we're, we're using our time somewhat efficiently. All's well that ends well. Am I right? So we can't go to Pisha yet, unfortunately. Because we haven't done the Giovanni Mansion Up yet. In. Santa Monica. The hops, bro. Woohoo! It's going great. I don't fully remember, uh, I don't fully remember all the pieces we need. Let's see, email, enter, next. Not a lot of time right now, gotta make this quick. Metalhead Industries, Hollywood, warehouse operation, key is in your mailbox, set up the hub. The terminal is in operations, back of the warehouse, top of some stairs, probably locked or electronically. Uh, work the problem, they're gonna have tight security, but you gotta keep it dark. They can't know you were there, same drill. Hello again, Scott told me that you interrupted a Sabat trial at the library, which almost got him killed. We are both very grateful for this, and he will make sure the access to the ritual chamber will be cut off in time. Needless to say that it might not be very smart to tell anyone about this, not even Sebastian. Nice. I think we got an experience point for that, even though it didn't notify us. Metalhead Industries. Back to Hollywood. Going somewhere. Hollywood. Man, this game always puts me in the mood to like play vampire movie or play vampire movies, watch vampire movies. 
Maybe that's what I'll do tonight after stream. Watch some vampire movies. Some flicks. Simply where says, which ones are you watching? I don't know. I wouldn't know. I, I haven't picked any yet. We will, I'll have to see. But the game always puts me in that mood for, for it. Maybe I'll watch some old like hammer horror, like the old Dracula and Bram Stoker's Dracula. That's not hammer horror, that's Francis Ford Coppola, but could be fun. Going somewhere. Save really quick. I kind of want to watch something really 90s as well. It could be fun. Where it says my favorite vampire movie is Martin. I uh, I like Martin. Martin's goofy. It's a fun movie. Okay, I can't, even if I rush there, it doesn't work. Cod piece. Stop doing that. Look. Okay. Nope. Might need to be sneaking.
Okay, we don't have high enough hacking for this. Still don't. Huh. Bang your head. Hmm. All right, let's look at our security. It says I need six hacking. What? Why does it not work? I failed to set up the Nosferatu network. Okay. Hey. Okay, he'll notice me if I open the door. Experience rewarded. Yay. Now can I increase my computer? I need nine for that. What increases computer? Or security, I think is what it, the stat is. Where is it? Hacking. Wits. Wits increases hacking. Oh, will this work? Uh, <sighs> hack attempt difficulty eight. Oh, we're so close. I need one more. Oh, that's rough. Kendo for advanced students, read. Give ourselves some more melee, some just free melee. Oh man, if we were so close to getting the, this. Time for us to escape. I wonder if we can come back here after this if we get more hacking. Oh, we can. Okay, cool. Let's go back to our email. Where to? just get whatever experience uh, this offers us. Whoa, she zoomed. 
She's zooming, boys. She's going. This is a big one. Kuejin front in Chinatown called Kamikaze Zen. Yeah, I know it's Japanese. Don't ask. They've got heavy duty security system. Recon's coming. Once you're in, find the server room and activate the hub. One more thing. They have a vault where they keep software, etc. You better break into it and take something. Put them off the scent. This one can be messy. It's your ass. Key is in, uh, to the front door is in your mailbox. Our inside man put a file called Hooligan on one of the office terminals. It's a virus. Find it and execute it. This will shut down the power and allow you to get past the first real security door. I never got any blueprints to the inner sanctum, so once you're past the first door, you're on your own to find the server room and the vault. Good luck. Interesting. All right, so we, we, we got some more there. We still have a little ways to go before we can really do much. Uh, instantly, our melee score is a lot higher than it was before, so that's pretty nice. We still have pretty low strength, so it doesn't really matter that much. Uh, we could go to get dexterity up. But we're specking pretty hard into the intelligence in, in like, for lack of a better word, charisma tracks, so... Unfortunately, we'll need to make some sacrifices there. Let's go back to Hollywood and do the Tawny Sessions mission. And then when we return to Amalia, we can find the CD for Bertram. Need a ride. I thought it said that she lived across from... Hmm. Where is it? We do need to go to the sin bin. Where is Tawny? Where does she live? I don't remember. All right. <clears throat> Let's go downstairs. There she is, the blonde one. Alright. Can't do anything with that, I don't think. Let's go upstairs and yell at the manager. What can I do? Uh, I see the girl who wears her heart on her back. Uh, yeah. Chastity. She works downstairs in the booths. But if you're looking for someone to, uh, pull your cork, <laughs> I got better girls than her. She ain't exactly adventuresome. Know what I'm talking about. Night Chastity is my vice. All right. It's your dollar. But if you want a private show, you're gonna have to wait until the booth customers clear out. The girls don't come out for one-on-one -on -one action until then. All right. Let's see. Private. What did we need here? Dirty dog.
Big John Farmer. Huh. Peep show. Lockdown. Confused says, yo, oh, oh, Seth is raiding with a party 27. Hey, Seth, thanks for raiding. We're about to um, attack a vampire hunter. All right, so room number one is broken. Hobbs is here as well. Hello, Hobbs. All right. Uh, what do I do here to to manage this? Hearts on order. What can I do? Here are my eyes. Show them your courtesy. Oh, he just has stuff. Never mind. Uh, hmm. Okay, so how are we gonna get the? How are we gonna get the the door open? Because we need to wait for the person to... We need to wait for the person to leave, but he doesn't leave. Yeah, I don't know. Seth says, hope it goes well. Well, thank you. That door's locked. This guy is dealt with. Is it bugged? Is there something I'm not understanding here? Ooh, lock picking. Money envelope, 150 bucks. Gladly take that. Nope. All right, so he will edit it. Yeah, or not edit it. He'll go in there to interact with it. Globo mecha window for assistance status log file chastity uh, inventory no I don't need inventory okay so that's locked I mean it's unlocked so we should oh she has a knife out they're ready to attack me the second I walk in there for interacting with that door. <sighs> Drain him. See if that knocks him out. He doesn't come over there. Now I do private or peep show unlock. Nope, that's good. Okay. Is this quest bugged? Is that what I'm experiencing right now?
what is going on? What do I gotta do? The patient, the, they're zoned out. There's nothing here. I can't interact with these, so they're all done. Do I go into the private room? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Log all champagne room transaction CR, include tips, report peep show revenue under PS, password center. Oh, okay. Now can I go talk to him with the doors all closed and trigger this quest? What can I? Uh, hear my eyes, show the mirror, courtesy, I need to mine your gray yeah. matter. Hollywood. Huh. Hardware? All right. You didn't hear it from me, but... Slater from the Red Spot. I think I already heard all that stuff. Hmm. All right, let's try to see. If I, I might need to interact with something. It seems like this might be bugged. Because I, th I think it is. Because, like, he's messed up. We can't interact with these. These are all set. So they shouldn't be... Let's try going outside and then coming back in. <clears throat> Version says it might be about them still being in the rooms. Oh! That door, that window opened, that one opened. Okay, maybe this fixed their uh, their AI. Let's check. Hmm. <laughs> They're coming. All right, so that's locked down. So we're gonna want to Window one is unavailable. And she's dancing with a katana. When can I unlock this? Let's see. Okay, let's lock this one while he's out. Oop. Cool. Should be good now. He's gone. That's gone. He can't leave. There we go. They're gone. Yeah. What are you looking for, honey? How about a free ride for, for an old friend in that other room? Oh. Okay. I'll just go back into the pleasure palace. I'll be back there later. Cool. Oh, she can see me. There we go. Perfect. And now we can take our job as the official dancer of the peep show. Called off, folks. Now let's go talk to Vel uh, Velvet. What can I do? All right, he's got nothing new to say, which is good. I was worried he would notice. That was weird. That was an odd little little bug. Bone huh? Rattle melodies and 
Go talk to Velvet. She'll be happy, I'm sure. Look who's back. Talking doll. Yes. About the hunting one. Mm-hmm. Hunter haunted. I know. I heard you from here. So you like loud noises, do you? I asked you to be quiet. All you've done is attract attention to yourself. And now you're in my club. You think there's any chance someone might make the connection? Are you kidding? I don't know if you've helped or made things worse. I stepped in a big pile of mistake. I did not mean to track it into the doll's house. Fine. Apology accepted. Only because no one else got hurt. Is she playing us? Interesting. All right. Tell me something. Mm hmm. Uh. Hollywood. What does this woman want me to do? Mingle. Sightsee. Chat. And me, of course. Tell me something else. Mm hmm What is your fable? Mm-hmm. How come you hide your true name behind a fabric, Susan? There's only one part of my body I don't want anyone entering. And that's my head. That other name? Never say it again. It belongs to a dead girl. NPC earlier did say something about not using disciplines near the hunter. Generally, when that is said, it means don't use disciplines that violate the masquerade. And because all of mine don't violate the masquerade, it shouldn't be a problem. Why are you hiding your past from me, doll? I'm not hiding my past. I'm not that girl. She was flawed. She was naive. She was nobody. And now she's dead. Let the dead rest in peace. My name is Vivi. Show yourself out. I'd like to say a prayer for someone I used to know. Pray then. Poor, poor... David Hatter. What's the matter? Is he mad? David Hatter's an aspiring screenwriter and hotel manager. He comes in more often than he would admit. Several years now. Poor dear just can't get a break. I overheard him talking about his new screenplay with one of my girls. It was about secret societies and creatures that found themselves dealing with inner beasts and persecution by elder monsters. Sound reminiscent of something to you? All too, a story I learned only recently, Kindred. Yes, the details of his story were too insightful to be coincidental. I think someone's working with David, a Kindred who doesn't realize the consequences of their actions. Do you know what the penalty for revealing ourselves to Kain is? Death, 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 and death. Death. I'm afraid poor David's big break. The screenplay he's worked so hard on must be destroyed, and his less than silent partner must be executed. I know David too well. I'm very fond of David, and I'm too close to do what needs to be done. Her voice acting is great. Hatter's play must remain unfinished and in a lot of pieces. I don't think Hatter knows his collaborator is kindred. You'll have to take David's screenplay. And somehow, you'll have to coax the name of his source out of him. Once you found out who, kill the traitor. But do not touch David. There will be no problem when I am through. David works at the Lucky Star Motel. He's very passionate about his writing. He loves to talk about his craft. I'm sure he'll talk about his screenplay. It may take some persuasion to get him to give up his collaborator's name, however. My ways are many and hilarious. After this is over, I promise you'll have my complete attention. I like attention. It's why I cut myself in large crowds. I'm gone. It's 2004, everyone. Th this is humor. This counted as humor back then. That was funny. These are all jokes. It was the Bush era, okay? People were dealing with a lot. 
All right, uh, let's see. So, we do need to go to the cafe as well to finish that little thingy. Let's go do that real quick. Save really quickly. More flatbread and olive oil. And take back the Chardonnay and open up a Chianti. Let it breathe for 20 minutes and then bring it out with a ziti. Okay? I'm not the one who waits. I wanted. I wanted to know what? Interrupt me while I'm working? Do you understand that this is an important opening and I, emphasize I, am going to make or possibly break this restaurant? Hmm. Justify your existence, devourer of souls. Me, Tommy Flayton, the food authority of Los Angeles, food critic for the biggest paper on the West Coast, radio personality for the KTLK, chower hour. Maybe if I reviewed more pancake huts, you'd know me. Walk away from this trough, Piggy, then tell the other Piggies not to eat here. Listen, Jackass, I didn't become the biggest critic in L.A. without making a few powerful friends. Half the owners of these places are criminals, and I eat at their table when I drop by. Are you enjoying your maggots? What? Maggots. You're eating maggots. <gasps> this place will pay for this. As sure as my name is Tommy Flayton, they'll never serve food in this town again. How could they do that to you? I bet they didn't even get that idea from a movie. He looks so mad. Look at him. Yes. I'm going to. A 60 foot robot would be cooler, but that will do. All right. Hey, look at that. Ooh, we, we, we really got a bunch of experience for that. That's pretty rad. Look at that beautiful skyline. Los Angeles, baby, this is what it was all about.